we love our teachers? Um, sometimes we do. And sometimes a little less, as they assign a lot of homework. <laughs> Just kidding. Teachers are very important in our lives. They say, a teacher takes a hand, opens a mind, and touches a heart. All of us agree to it, right? Teachers have a great impact on our future and our personality. Let me share with you a short and interesting story about a teacher and a student. A long time ago, the schools used to be in jungles. They were called gurukas. The teachers and the students lived in small huts, and these gurukas ended everything by themselves as a team. They cooked, cleaned, and washed all on their own. Fascinating, isn't it? In one such gurukul lived Guru Dhrunachriya, together with five Pandav brothers, and 100 Gaurav brothers. The five Pandav brothers and 100 Gaurav brothers were cousins. All of these young princes were the men of incredible power. One bright, sunny morning, Guru Dhanatriya said, Hello children, today I want to see who among you can strike the eye of that wooden bird across the river. The bird was really small from where they were standing, but the students were confident of their skills. Yudhisthir, eldest among the Pandavas, was called upon first. Yudhisthir, can you see the bird? Tell me everything you can see, asked Guru Dhanatriya. I see the wooden bird, the branch, and the tree. I can see the leaves moving and also see more birds sitting on the same tree, Yudhisthir answered. Dhanatriya commanded, put down your bow and take a seat, Yudhisthir. You will not hit the eye of the bird. Confused, Yudhisthir silently walked back to his brothers with a grim face. And the next boy who was called forward and asked the same question by the guru, he gave a similar answer. Once again, the boy was told to put away his bow. The same pattern continued with every boy that followed until finally Guru Dhanatriya reached Arjun. Tell me what you can see, Arjun, repeated Dhanatriya. I can only see the eye of the bird, replied Arjun, without breaking eye contact with his target. Can you not see the trees and the sky or the branch the bird is sitting on? The Guru inquired. No, sir. All I can see is the eye of the bird, and nothing else, he stated. Dhanatriya was pleased with this response. He cast a glance at the crowd of boys who were held in silence, but slowly began nodding their heads as the lesson became clear to them. Shoot, Dhanatriya instructed, and bam, the arrow hits the eye. Perfect shot. After a long pause, Dhanatriya patted Arjun's back and turned around and looked at all the students and said, Now you see, young princes. The power of concentration. The way a teacher helps bring out the best in the students, no one else can. Awards or punishment, whatever it be, the teacher always does everything for his students. So this Guru Purnima, let us all thank our teachers for helping us become the best and the way we were meant to be. Culture Dubba is a monthly subscription that teaches kids about India in a fun and educational way. Get your boxes today at culturedubba.com.